This is a story about two friends, a bear and a unicorn. The unicorn's name was Pinky and the bear's name was Lugu. And they were such good friends. They love to do everything together. They go to movies together. They go shopping together. They go to the park together. And they loved best of all to go to the swimming pool. They loved the swimming pool. They went every Saturday, and they would go every day if they were allowed. But their grown-ups said, no, 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 no. So they went on Saturdays. And they went, and Lugu loved to swim. Lugu would go in the pool. Pshum, splash, splash. Lugu's huge, right? He's a bear. Boom, splash, splash, whoosh. And Pinky, well, Pinky, Pinky was afraid of the water. And he still loved it. He, still, he liked to go to the pool, but he was afraid. He wouldn't go in. He liked to run around and he'd, he'd jump from one side of the pool to the other. Like that. All day long. You know, it was fun. But Lugu was like, oh, come on, Pinky, come on. Come on and have some fun. And Pinky would say, uh, uh, I'm not going in there. And they tried to figure out how they could get Pinky to go in the water. Now, one thing they tried was floaties. They figured, well, let's put some floaties on the unicorn. Um, and so they couldn't figure out what to do. How do you put a floaty on a unicorn? So they, they, they tried putting on its horn, and, and that, that wasn't going to work. They, they tried putting it on its tail, but that wasn't going to work. Because if you, the unicorn goes in the water with a floaty on his tail, he's just going to go like this. Bloop! Right? His tail's going to go up, and his head's going to sink. And so they couldn't do that. And then they put a big one instead right around his chest and he said no i am not going in the water like that i know i'm a unicorn named pinky but 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 i am scared and i look ridiculous so he took off the floaties well the very next time they were there pinky was jumping back and forth again boing 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 Boing, boing. And Lugu was in the pool, of course. Boing, rum, zoom, zoom, splash, boom, shoo. And the, you, the lifeguard was over there. And the lifeguard was watching. And he had an idea. Wait a second. Pinky likes to jump. Pinky's afraid to go in the water. He had an idea. He went and got a big trampoline. And he dragged it over to the pool deck and put it right beside the pool. And said, Pinky, try this thing. And Pinky looked at that trampoline. And he said, no way. I'm not going on no trampolines. I like jumping just the way I am. And I'm not going on a trampoline. Pinky was nervous. Now, Lugu was in the pool. And he was like, oh, hmm. What's that thing? Oh, it looks like fun. And so Lugu got out of the pool, <laughs> dried himself off a little bit. <laughs> and then he went up to the up to the trampoline and decided to jump. Now, there's that little thing called physics, right? Well, let's talk about it for a second. And trampolines. If your mouse goes on a trampoline, he's just little, right? If a mouse goes on a trampoline, he's just gonna jump and just go boing. If something a little bigger goes on the trampoline, like like you, boing, 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 boing. If a grown-up goes on a trampoline, we go boing, boing, boing. And if a big bear like Lugu goes on a trampoline, he goes boing, 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 boing. Uh-oh. Lugu went up, 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 up. In the air. And that's another thing about physics. When you go up, sooner or later, you will go down. <laughs> it's true. So Lugu went up in the air. Lugu came down, down. And when he landed in the pool, of course, there was an enormous splash. Water went 
everywhere. Not all over the pool. Not all over the pool deck. Not all over the park. No, no, no. The water went all over Kitchener Waterloo. Got totally soaking wet everywhere. That very day. K6, that's, that's us. K6, or room 14. We are out for a field trip. And we were just playing, playing, I don't know, playing soccer or playing tag or something fun. And suddenly down came the big splash on top of us. We got all wet, soaking wet. And so we had to figure out how we're going to solve this problem. And oh, one of the kids said, well, we've got dry clothes at home. We can just go there. Well, I thought, mm, we, we, we can't all go. Well, I guess we could all go home if we all go together. So we had a little parade. We all walked around town, one by one, to everyone's houses. The first house we went to was Peter's house. We went up, and Peter knocked on the door. Peter's dad came to the door, and he looked at us, and we looked at him, and he looked at Peter, and he looked at us and we looked at him and Peter's dad said why is my son all wet we looked at each other and then we said well there were these two friends you see there's Pinky and Lugu and I mean, Pinky was a unicorn and Lugu was a bear and they liked to do all kinds of things they were best friends and they, but they loved to go to the swimming pool the best and they went to the swimming pool one day and then they like Pinky or Lugu liked to go to the pool but the Pinky no 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 Pinky just liked to jump back and forth back and forth back and forth and so the uh, um, lifeguard went and got a big trampoline and put it next to the pool and the, uh, Pinky wouldn't go on it but Lugu did Lugu's a bear right boing 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 boing, boing physics right boing boing, boing boing up in the air and sploosh down it went boom and the water went everywhere, and we got wet. Peter's dad, like any grown-up would, looked at us and shook his head. Well, one of the kids, I think it was Stevie, she looked at Peter's dad and said, But, but Peter's dad, you see, look around. Kitchener's covered in puddles. Did it rain today? Peter's dad thought for a minute. He checked his phone just in case he missed something. No, it didn't rain today. Well, where did all the puddles go? Where did all the puddles come from, we said. Hmm, said Peter's dad. Well... It was only because there was an enormous splash. Where else would puddles come if it wasn't raining? Peter's dad thought. And he looked at us. And he said, Well, maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. Maybe it's true.